people ask me if Steven Spielberg, when we did Blaze of Glory at DreamWorks, gets involved. And so we had tracked the movie like a s classic sports drama, basically also, because we, that was one task we kind of gave ourselves. Stuart Kornfeld, another alumni and myself, that the movie had to work. If you took all the comedy away, it still had to work as a, as a skating movie, an athlete, you know, a sports movie where you really cared, you know, and were invested in the characters winning or making it. And then we did get one uh, memo from him saying, you have to come up with something in the third act that trumps all of the other uh, uh, physical uh, uh, deeds in the movie, set pieces, or the audience will be disappointed. It doesn't matter what genre it is. And that's when we came up with the Korean, North Korean um, death-defying skating feat that had only been tried once and it ended with you know, the skater's head being cut off. And, and that was really half the people I've ever talked to who love the movie's favorite thing in the whole movie. So, so you know, he was absolutely right.